हेलो स्टूडेंट वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल एन जे मैथ वर्ल्ड टुडे आई एम हियर टू एक्सप्लेन यू फर्स्ट सेमेस्टर बीसीए मैथमेटिकल फाउंडेशन क्वेश्चन पेपर फेब्रवरी मार्च ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री सेशन बी आंसर एनी फोर क्वेश्चंस विच ईच क्वेश्चन कैरीज सिक्स मार्क्स सो यह वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन नंबर वन दैट इज प्रूव दैट पी डबल इम्प्लीकेशन क्यू डबल इम्प्लीकेशन ऑफ नेगेशन पी और क्यू और नेगेशन क्यू और पी इज आर टोटोलॉजी टोटोलॉजी इज नथिंग बट वी हैव टू प्रूव द ओवरऑल द थ्रू टू स्टेटमेंट द लास्ट आंसर फुल कॉलम शुड हैव द वैल्यू एज थ्रू देन इट इज कॉल्ड एज टोटल टोटोलॉजी इज नथिंग बट वेन द प्रिपोजिशन वैल्यू दैट इज सोल्यूशन बिकम्स थ्रू फॉर ऑल द गिवन प्रिपोजिशन सो यह वी विल प्रूव इट वी हैव P and Q, so we have here first one is P double implication Q. Then we'll go for the second one. We have negation P, negation P or Q. Then we'll go for next bracket, negation Q, negation Q or P. Let me call this as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. we can find here that is we have here column 5 and a column 7 and the condition for both is or so we'll write 5 or 7 then we will take the overall one the overall is we can see it is third element that is first bracket is third one and then this over uh, uh, is your eighth column so this one so we will take third double implication eight one so let me prove this so we have t t f f t f t f so yeah double implication is nothing but it's a condition where if it is t and t it is t even if it is false and false it is t remaining all it will be false so let me check for this condition where i have t and t it is t f and f it is t if not the remaining will be false then next one is negation of p negation p means reversing this p value that is f f t t so now we'll be taking negation p and q that is we are going to check for negation p and q so here negation p or q is or condition is or is if it is f and f it is f if not it is true so we'll just check in this two column if it is f and f we should write it as false we have here f and f it is false otherwise it is true then we'll go for the negation of q q negation is if it is t it is f it is if f it is t if it is t it is f if it is f it is t now we need to check for now we need to check for negation p that is sixth one and p that is first one we'll be checking in the first column and sixth column for this condition negation p or q or is again a statement where it is false and false it is false if not it is true so we'll be checking in this too whether it is having false and false yes we have here false and false it is false remaining all it is true value it is t so now we have to check again next one is we have to check in 5 or 7 so 5 is this 5 Or seven, we have to check in five or seven. Again, what is the condition for or? For condition for or is f and f. If it is f, if not it is true. We don't have f and f. We don't have f and f. We don't have f and f. We don't have. So the whole value is t, 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 and t. Now the last one we need to check for third one. We need to check for third one and for eighth one. Double implication that is T and T T F and F T. If not, it is false. So yeah, T and T it is T. 
f and t it is false f and t it is false t and t it is t here we can find that the values what we got in the last table the last value what we got is not true the values are not true it is a mixture of both therefore therefore the the given proposition given proposition p impl double implication q double implication negation p or q or negation q or p is not a tautology because it is not having all values as true hence it is not a tautology hence the problem is proved thank you for watching if you like and follow my explanation subscribe share and comment on my channel thank you students